Hello everyone and welcome back to another tutorial. Today we'll be exploring an exciting feature on Chameleon, adding custom fonts. Before we start, I recommend checking out our guide about web fonts and web safe fonts that you'll find in the link uh, below. It's important to know that although web fonts and web safe fonts sound the same, they are completely different. Web safe fonts are fonts that are already installed by default in our computers. They are safe to use and render perfectly on almost every email client and device. The most popular web safe fonts are Arial, Verdana, Georgia, Times New Roman. And they are fonts that you can find by default in your Chameleon email editor. Web fonts are fonts that are not pre-installed, so you have to host them on your server or on an external server. There are many web fonts out there, most notably Google fonts, like my favorite Poppins. Following your brand guidelines, you might find yourself obligated to use a web font or a custom font in your email designs, and we've got the perfect solution for that. We'll take the example of this email template we found on reallygoodemails.com. As you can see here, the brand added a headline in this font that is clearly not a standard web safe font. However, with a quick inspection, we found that the title is actually an image which is a big no-no in email design. And it turns out that all the headlines in this email are actually images. Here's what that looks like on Outlook desktop, for example, where images are automatically blocked by the email client. The email looks broken and most of the email message is lost. In order to fix this, there is a simple solution, which is to simply use one of the web safe fonts already available in Chameleon. We found that the Verdana is the closest font similar to the fonts used in the original email. Or you can upload your custom font to Chameleon. First, start by finding your brand font on fonts.google.com. We found that the fonts used by Musicbed in this email are Rubik and DM Serif Display. Next, navigate to the custom fonts section in your Chameleon account. You need to provide a font URL under the font URL settings. Every font link should include the following font styles, regular 400, regular 400, italic, bold 700, and bold 700 italic. If you would like to use your custom font, you need to host it publicly on the internet. The font CSS should be compiled by your developer team, and finally you need to provide us with a similar URL. So now go back to Google Fonts and select the necessary styles. Regular 400, regular 400 italic, bold 700 and bold 700 italic. Then copy the link generated in the panel on the right. The link should start after the hrefs equal sign. Copy the link, click on add font URL in Chameleon and paste the link after naming it, of course. Then hit save. Now you need to define the font stack to ensure that email clients that don't support custom fonts will display your text in a similar web safe font. Make sure that the fallback font has the same similar uh, type as the web font you selected, so serif or sans serif. Preferably use web safe fonts as fallbacks like Arial, uh, Verdana, uh, Times New, New Roman. Choose fallback fonts that have similar X height, which is the letter height, to make sure that your email designs won't completely be messed up when only the fallback font shows up. And finally, make sure to include serif or sans serif at the end of your font stack. So in this case, the font stack we need is Rubik, Verdana, Tahoma, Arial, Helvetica, and then we finish with sans serif. We do the same for the second font, and in this case, we only have regular 400 and regular 400 italic available, so we will only add those to our font URL. Again, go back to Chameleon, add the font name and URL, and then add the font stack. Your new fonts will automatically be added in the editor. To use them, simply click on the text box, 
search for your font and click on it. As simple as that. As you can see, both fonts look exactly like they are supposed to in the editor as well as in the preview. And there you have it, a quick and bulletproof way to send perfect emails with your brand fonts. You can try it in Chameleon for free during your free trial. And thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next tutorial.